Jennifer Lopez, 48, displays impossibly tiny midsection as she models skin-tight dress in New York City high-rise for second act. Jennifer Lopez has always stayed in top shape thanks to daily workouts at home and tips from Wuna Golfer's trainer Tracy Anderson. But on Saturday, the 48-year-old performer was looking especially slender as she posed for a portrait while on the New York City set of her new rags to reach his Thomas second act. The shades of blue actress looked like a size zero in a skin-tight dress that had a belt which made her waist look almost impossibly tiny. This iron added seven-inch heels in black and gold that had a round toe. The Ahmad 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 singer wore her hair up in a bun and added large gold earrings that matched a ring on her middle finger. Lopez is known for having a very small waist but it looked smaller than usual, perhaps thanks to recent trips to a Manhattan gym with Bo Alex Rodriguez. The star was standing in a luxury high-rise in New York City looking out at the city's impressive skyline. Her movie Second Act is about a Costco-type worker who makes it big on Wall Street. Her co-stars are Vanessa Hudgens and Leah Remini. This post comes after Jennifer said that A-Rod should manage the New York Yankees baseball team. If he gets the job, he would be the team's 35th manager. The singer-actress retweeted an article about the Yankees manager search on Thursday in which she lent some support to the retired 42-year-old slugger. It couldn't be clearer, she tweeted, adding, number sign A-Rod for Yankees manager. The Yankees declined to re-sign manager Joe Girardi despite the fact that the team reached the American League Championship Series, where New York fell to the eventual World Series champion Houston Astros. Under Girardi, the Yankees won the World Series in 2009, but according to a number of reports, the team is looking for manager who does a better job of connecting with players. Yankees general manager Brian Cashman announced Friday morning that the team is done interviewing candidates. I'm closing the doors on the six we've interviewed, Cashman said Friday, according to the New York Post. From that, we'll make a recommendation. It's time to make a recommendation to ownership and go from there. Rodriguez was not interviewed for the position. Cashman's candidates reportedly include the recently retired Carlos Beltran, ESPN broadcaster Aaron Boone, San Francisco Giants bench coach Hemsley Mullins, Yankees executive Rob Thompson former Cleveland Indians and Seattle Mariners manager Eric Wedge, and Los Angeles Dodgers third base coach Chris Woodward. Like Rodriguez, both Beltran and Boone played for the Yankees. While it does not appear her support will help him land the Yankees' managerial position, Rodriguez described Lopez as a great coach in his personal life. She's a good coach to have, he told that. I think we're just best friends. We just love spending time together. Our kids love each other. So it's a good thing. It's what it's all about, he continued. It's a good time for us, and it's great to be supporting and loving towards each other.